Hello, welcome back. I'm nervous. Nervous for the flight? My astrology is scared for flying. Because but we are finally we are now in the airplane and now we will fly to Dubai. Yeah. We are sitting in the very back side so that means um, that means it's more like you know <laughs> <laughs> it's just hold me, hold me, hold me. because so far it's we are on time and we give you update again later oh my god We've been walking for like 30 minutes now and we're still not yet done. So long. The airport here in Dubai is so so huge. And we come from the end to the beginning. And our gate is C um, C4. So first we pass the A, I don't know, 50, B50. And then when we are in C, it starts from 50 to C1. So imagine how long is that. <sighs> Good thing we still have two hours left to walk. Now Angie needs to go to the toilet and then me later. But I'm so, so tired. <laughs> Guys, we arrived here. But I broke my ankle on my knee from walking. Mm. Yeah, it was a long walk, right? Yeah, longest walk in the airport I've had so far. Mm. Now we're waiting for the airplane going to Frankfurt and then we are finally there. Oh no, then we need to drive, drive train. Train? Mm. How long train again? And bus. Guys, we got a free upgrade to the business class. So no
welcome back in Germany. Thank you so much, sir. <laughs> <laughs> so what I meant. But this guy was nice. Yeah, he's nice. Yeah. The moment I realized that I'm in Germany is when I heard most oh. of the people speaking in German and I missed that. <laughs> because Andrew don't speak with me in German and that's why I want to I think this is the best way of learning learning my German language again. Hmm. Yeah, cronies now we are here. Uh, uh, finally the Life was amazing. Um, now we are waiting for our luggage and then we need to go to the train station. Yo. So now we will check in the moment. So that was very very quick. Um, they interviewed the guy interviewed me if I know how to speak German and I said a little bit but I understand everything what he's saying and he said to me that I'm not allowed to work or anything that has something to do with working here in Germany and earning money and we also said yeah no problem and he asked how long I will stay here I said two and a half month and we have um, uh, back and forth we have back and forth ticket already so I said, yeah, okay, no problem. And they asked Andre if he will be the one to shoulder everything. And Andre said, yeah. And then they gave me um, stampe, stampe, um, stamps, stamp. And we are waiting here for our luggage. So while I was on the plane, I was looking around already. And it's, it's really like in a... Um, country side in Germany because it's full of trees and like my first and second third time here was always in the city so far from the nature and I love nature so I think it would be great but so far it was amazing we have luck this time everything went so smooth we had a little bit problem with Andres visa but we were able to fix them everything and then let's see now you are in germany so tell them what did you say about germany completely different but i will be making separate vlog about my observations, the differences between in the Philippines and in Germany as a Filipina, you know. <laughs> and uh, two obvious things that I see even just the first few minutes arriving in the Philippines is the wires, the yeah. electric wires and the cleanliness of the city. <laughs> in the Philippines when you arrive in Manila and get out outside the airport you see a lot of wires, a lot of traffic, the dirt is, the garbages are all over, you know. Here, <laughs> you was like, is there somebody living here actually? <laughs> <laughs> so, finally we have tickets. We are driving now with the train because car is way more expensive. I have this feeling after one year being away from Germany, I, I'm in a new country because I have still the prices from last year in my mind but it's so much more expensive now. So now I will buy for my Asawa pretzel because this is what she likes and she was waiting for it long long time so I hope I will be able to buy it. So now I will see the reaction of my Asawa because she loves pretzel and she was always talking about it that she wants to eat pretzel again and now we will see her reaction Asawa Smells good <laughs> That's what you missed Try it 
show them. This is, what is this shot again? Pretzel. Pretzel, yeah. Two for you. Mm. <laughs> I like the salt pepper. Thank you. Okay, so now you type in what you want. Three, three. Okay, and then? And then, do it. the money. Yeah, first you do it. First three, three. You take a video. Okay, so first... Hi, hi. So now you make the money. One by one. Here? No, there. There, yeah. Correct. And now you need to push. <laughs> so when I come back in the Philippines, I will never ever complain that everything is so expensive because if in the Philippines, if the prices in the Philippines are double, here it's like five times more expensive. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Now we are in sick workshops. Okay. We passed Andre's hometown. He showed me. Village. Uh. And behind this train, yeah. there on this side, there was the old business school where I was 15 oh. years ago. Really? <laughs> so where's the bus station? We're gonna go to bus yeah. station. So now we are here at the bus station. Our bus comes in 14 minutes. And yeah, this bus drives us directly to my place. And I think then we will rest a little and I will show my house where I grown up in my childhood. Yeah, and then we finally arrived after almost 24 no yeah 24 hours trip no over 30 hours traveling ay, ay, ay. and my Asawa she's changing her shoes because she realized that wearing high heels is not the best way for traveling Shots, tell them the truth what is the truth my shoes are so heavy and I'm scared it will be overweight and that's why I wear the thick the thick jeans and thick shoes mm -hmm. and I lost my slipper in the airport <laughs> yeah the brown one? I, yeah, the brown one I forgot where? in business class you forgot them in the business class? because you said how is it? Yeah, why you go to the toilet when, when the plane is landing? Why you cannot go before landing? Because it's my first time that on a business class, you know, I didn't know that the first one needs to get out. <laughs> they blocked the economy from going out because we were still there. 
So the whole economy was waiting for you. Yeah, so that's why I'd rather lose my cheap slipper. <laughs> but I have new slipper look. Ooh, fancy. This is in Germany train plans, okay, or well, bus plans. Mm -hmm. Here you see the number of the bus and where we are. Mm -hmm. 512. And then you can see here 512. And you see from Erlinghoven, that's our place, mm -hmm. this goes to Ittenbach. And here 537, Erlinghoven Oberpleis, you know? So how you can read it. Here you see Monday, Friday, Monday to Friday, Samstag is Saturday, and Sunday and holidays. Yeah. And then you can see here, this is Numbers. the hours, mm. the hour, ah, hours, yeah. and that's the minutes. So when you check now, we have now what every time? Every 34 minutes. Every nine. Every nine hour 34. Look, nine hour 35. For one, one minute ago we stopped ah, here. Ah, because it's every hour, right? Yeah, correct. You can see at 10.30, at 10.34, there comes a bus. Ah, okay, okay. Here, you can see the 537, mm -hmm. okay, always on 17, mm -hmm. okay? So every hour, 17 minutes. What is this 47? That's the second time. Ah. So here, for so example, two times in an hour. Two times. Always at 12.17 and at 12.47 comes the bus. Yeah. And then you need to know for everyone here, when you guys want to come to Germany, here you see S, A, B. And then here you can see, for an example, the uh, S at uh, 3 p.m. 2 minutes, just on school days, you know, nur an ah, Schultag. Yeah. Okay? So, okay. and then here you can also see, that is very good, this is something I've missed in the Philippines, the bus drivers cannot trick you because here is a price list so you are here now in my country uh, in my home place mm -hmm. when you wanna drive somewhere for example you wanna drive to Bonn yeah. Bonn is 2B you can see it's here orange so it's here. correct and then you see one ticket for one person cost 4 mm -hmm. euro okay. so you can always see here where I wanna go Col Cologne here Köln yeah. Okay, it's four, and then you pay eight euro for one ticket. Okay. You understand? No, I understand, guys. Good. I hope there will be something like that in the Philippines. And this is. There is no such foreigner, you know? So just imagine, guys, I am considered as foreigner here in Germany, and if the buses would be same like in my country, I would pay double, you know, because they always charge double to foreigners. Yeah. And you know. For me, when because I'm here, I could feel, you know, I would be like feel unfair in my side because I'm here and what if they um, charge me double? But for foreigners on the other side, they would always feel unfair because they always need to be um, double always more expensive you know hmm. Chat, we are there yeah we're finally at andres house but we don't want to parents house oh uh, yeah parents house but we don't want to um f film uh walk and filming because in germany it's different in the <laughs> philippines it's okay you can show the entire house here yeah. in the in Germany or other part of Europe or country, they're very, very conservative and so strict when it comes to privacy. It's true. And most of the Filipina don't understand that, but I know that already, so... So how do um, you feel? How was the travel? Travel was so, so good. It, at first I was so scared because of the turbulence and I made a screenshot of the comments in YouTube that Turbulence is not a problem. <laughs> problem is food or other stuff, and that kind of helped me. 
So yeah, <laughs> every time there's turbulence, I always try to go back and read <laughs> turbulence is not, <laughs> is that a problem? <laughs> and then yeah. So what we're gonna do now? We're gonna end this vlog here and the next vlog you will see me um, enjoying the festival here. Yeah. So we're gonna get ready and see you in the next vlog. Correct guys, we have here, it's funny because we arrived today and today we have a festival, a small festival here in my home place. So I will meet all friends and maybe also my sisters they are here and they doesn't know that I'm coming. Yeah, that's so the most interesting. It will be interesting for me also to see the reaction of my sisters. And my, I can see my niece and nephew. Yeah. <laughs> you cannot but I'm wait not for allowed them. to. Andre and told me already that I'm not allowed to do like this yeah. the way I treat them so it will be <laughs> and the funny sure. thing is that one year every time when I call my niece and nephew they always ask me uncle when you come back can you come back and I always say yeah soon soon mm. and now it's soon <laughs> yeah <laughs> so I will show you my asawa here our place the house where I grown up mm. and you know then we get ready and we see us in the next vlog bye bye, bye, -bye.